Another great tool is to put on a launcher that is designed for the visually impaired community. This one is called Big Launcher and that is exactly what it is and look at that. It is huge in your face but this once again is great for me. I would not need to use my magnifier if I wanted to quickly call someone or quickly take a picture. SMS. I just push on the giant phone icon there and it takes me into my recent calls and I can jump into my contacts here and you see everything is really big and easy to read. Very simple layout. So a launcher might like this might be a good option for you. Now this next feature of Android is one that I probably use the most, hands down. Every single day I'm using this. It is the speech to text function uh, on Android and it's great, I love it. So let's see. Hey, what's going on? Question mark. What are you doing today? Question mark. I can't wait to go see the movie, exclamation mark. Hey, comma. Pick me up at 9 p.m. Period. So that is just, why would you ever type again when you can just do that? So another cool feature of the Android phones going along with the speech to text is the ability to search using your voice. If I long press on the search button here, the magnifying glass, it will launch the Google Voice search. Walmart. Now you see, I actually have the Walmart phone number in my contacts, so it brought that up as well as searches in on Google and you can choose which one you want. We'll do the search instead and there you go it's showing local Walmarts near me and I can either just call or I can get directions say I just want to call it takes me right into my phone here. Now finally I want to show a personal assistant app. Hi there, friend. This one is called Speak to It Assistant, and this one is by far my favorite. These are very much like Siri for the iPhone, uh, only better, I think. You can completely customize your avatar if you want to. Uh, I'll probably be doing a full review on this application soon, but you can use her to access many different systems on your phone and she will do it for you just by speaking to her. What time is it? 8.55 a.m. What's the weather like today? Now in Lexington it is currently partly cloudy, 57 degrees Fahrenheit. 14 degrees Celsius. You can have her dial numbers. Dial 2458425. Okay. Just press call and I'll connect you to 2458425. Good to see you. What can I do for you today? You can have her send messages. Send a message to Rachel. How are you? Here's the SMS to be sent to Rachel. How are you? Should I send it now? No. You can have her call contacts. Call Dylan. So very quick, easy ways to perform common functions on your phone. 
You can also use her to set alarms, change calendar events. Uh, you can update Facebook status. Update status, great day. I'm going to post this as your new Facebook status, great day. Is that right? Yes. Your Facebook status was updated to great day. So I hope that helps out, guys. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below for me. I'd be happy to take a look at those. As always, this was Sam with MobileTechVideos.com. You can find us on Twitter and Facebook. Come check us out on the web. Let us know if we can do anything to help. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.